Hi everyone. In this video, we will see a mechanism in which two discs are rotated by simple motion, using SOLIDWORKS 2017. So let's start. I'll open the already made parts by me. This is base, for providing pivots for arm and discs. We will have a quick view at the sketch. The top circle is pivot for arm. The bottom circles are pivots for discs. Now we will see the operating arm. Two extrusions are provided to fit in disc slots. Let's have a quick view of sketch. The pivotal centers of arm and discs have been considered. The arm lengths and positions are big enough to rotate the discs in desired direction. Now we will see the right side disc. We will see the sketch for slot. Again, consider the rotation centers. The initial and final position of arm is plotted on the disc. Considering 75 degree rotation of disc for 12 degree rotation of arm. Make a slot profile connecting those positions. 0.2 mm offset is provided for clearance. Now we will see left side disc. Let's see the sketch. We have plotted the sketch similar to right side disc sketch. Disc rotation of 75 degrees is considered for 12 degree rotation of arm. Connect the initial and final positions using a slot. Now we will open a new assembly file. Inserting the base component. We will quickly change its appearance. Now, insert the arm. Change the appearance of arm as well. Insert the discs into the assembly. We will mate the discs and arm on the base pivots, for free rotation. Make sure that the arm has rightly fitted into the disc. The parts rotations is also proper.
save the file. Let's go to motion study. We will go to basic motion mode. We will now change some settings. Add the contact between arm and the discs. We will now give motor input to the arm. Keep the motion as distance. Enter the distance as 12. Click calculate. We see that the arm pushes the discs to rotate inwards, by 75 degrees. We will now make the left disc rotate by 90 degrees and right disc by 60 degrees. Go to the left disc and open the sketch. We will change this 75 degrees to 90 degrees. Now open the right disc and edit sketch. Change 75 degrees to 65 degrees. Open the assembly. Go to the motion study and again click on calculate. We see more rotation of left disc compared to right disc. Hope this video was helpful. Thank you.